Get Real says, do not pray to Mary. And as a Catholic, I just want to tell you that we live in a communion of saints. And the epistle of Hebrews says that we are surrounded by a great cloud of witnesses. Is that true or is it false? The Bible says it is true. Therefore, we are surrounded by a great cloud of witnesses. St. Paul also says for us to pray for one another. So when a Christian dies, they're in heaven with Jesus. They continue to pray with us as a cloud of witnesses and for us. So when we Catholics ask Mary to pray for us, which we do every single day, it's just like me asking my mom to pray for me, my dad to pray for me, my wife to pray for me, my neighbor to pray for me, or my pastor to pray for me. There is no sin in it. In fact, it is very powerful. Protestants often talk about having prayer chains where, you know, someone gets hit by a car and they all get on the phone and say, pray for John, pray for John, hit by a car, prayer chain, prayer chain, prayer chain. Why are they doing that? They don't think Jesus is enough? No, they believe that when you get people together who love Jesus to pray, 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 it moves the heart of God. We Catholics believe the same thing. We just believe the prayer chain goes up, up and out. So Protestants getting on here and saying, don't pray to Mary or whatever, you guys don't get it. You need to go read your Bibles, read the New Testament, and realize that we have communion with the saints in heaven. Remember when Elijah and Moses appeared with Jesus? They were dead. Well, they're not actually dead. Uh, well, Moses, yes, Elijah assumed in heaven. It's getting a little complicated. But they're not here on earth with, with us anymore, and yet they still have communication with us. Read Revelation chapter 5, verse 8. You'll see that the 24 elders in heaven are helping with their incense and the angels are presenting the prayers of people on earth to Jesus, the Lamb of God. They are submediating our prayers to Jesus. That's in the Bible once again. So Catholics are doing it the right way. We're doing it the biblical way. Protestants are the one that have that misunderstood. I'm sorry, get real, but please get real. 